Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and today we're looking at the Tapo TC70 camera. If you're not already subscribed, don't forget to subscribe before we get started. This video forms part of our new series, A Pet Owner's Perspective. What that means is in the first half of the video, we'll be giving our general feedback on this camera. And in the second part of the video, we'll be relating it to pet owners specifically. So in this instance, we'll be talking about using this camera as a pet security monitoring camera, for example, while you're at work. So just to get started, I'm going to demonstrate to you the camera's 360 degree horizontal rotation and it's 114 degree vertical rotation. So you can see it moving up and down there, that black plastic centerpiece. And then in a second, you'll see the dome starting to rotate. I will speed this clip up in a minute or be here for ages, but as you can see, it very easily rotates. And this is all controlled from the app, as you will see later. So as you can see here, on Amazon in the UK, at the moment the camera retails for £23.99 on its deal price, but it's normally £30.31. £30, so bear that in mind throughout the video, it is a budget camera. Also, bear in mind, I have had this camera for over a month now, so I'm giving you my honest feedback and it's not some sort of quick slapdash testing. So here are some of the key pieces of information about the camera found on Amazon. So it's got motion detection, night vision, up to 128 gigabyte SD card, privacy mode, 1080p crystal clear image, sound and light alarm, and then obviously it's got its rotations. I love night vision, I love motion detection, I love the SD card, I love the image. I don't really use privacy mode and the sound and light alarm, which I talk about later, isn't really that effective. In terms of the volume, I can easily talk over the alarm and it's not that loud at all, so definitely won't scare intruders. Now this is the ceiling or wall mount. It's very easy to take off and put back on. It's held in by two screws and it's held up very well, never fallen off or anything like that. And it's obviously very easy to install and very easy to remove if you need to. So, as you can see here, the application is great. I only have the free version that comes with it, but you've got functions such as talk, pan and tilt, which is the 360 degree rotation and 180 degree vertical rotation. You've also got voice call, privacy mode, alarm, tap OK, playback and memory. So I have an SD card, so you can go to playback and memory and you can scroll back through your recordings and as you can see that's loading here now so that is great if you want to watch videos back for security so this short clip here demonstrates my cat waking up when his automatic food machine dispensed food into his bowl there will be a video on that coming so stick around and keep checking back on the channel but what i'm trying to emphasize here is that it's 705 in the morning so there's a good amount of light but you can see here the camera quality is excellent so you could easily identify an intruder or in my instance you could easily check up on your pet during the day. Luckily for you during the night a fly was buzzing around the room so the camera recorded some motion at 2.45am and you can see the camera quality here during a pitch black night. I think the quality is extremely good and for my instance you can easily check up on a cat Another great feature is the privacy mode. I don't personally use this because it's a cat camera and there's nothing particularly private there. But if this was inside your property, for example, your lounge or maybe even your hallway, you can turn privacy mode on and as you can see, it just stops the camera from recording or displaying anything. There's also a built-in alarm on this, as you can also see on the screen. It's okay, it's a good deterrent, but it's not loud at all, so it's not gonna make a commotion. But as a deterrent, it's good enough. In the top right hand corner you can choose from low quality and high quality and then you can also choose from night mode to day mode to automatic. There's also settings such as time zone and invert image. What inverting the image does means that if, like me, you've got it wall mounted on a ceiling, it will flip the image around so that you're not looking at your room upside down. Really important to remember that. You can also adjust side to side as you can see here. You simply select it and you can control it from the app as well as up and down. There's also a setting where you can schedule it to look at different points in the room and it will remember that spot. For example, in my cat's room, I have it set to the cat view, but then I can also move it around to the window view, for example, if I want to look outside. 
thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe to Raffi Cat TV there are more videos coming in the future starring Raffi there may even be one from his perspective in the near future there are also more product testing videos in this series of a pet owner's perspective don't forget to subscribe thank you so much for watching